The cities of Gatlinburg, Pigeon Forge, and Sevierville, Tennessee are awesome, but they have weird names, so let's take a look at how they got them. Despite being founded by the Ogle family in the early 1800s, Gatlinburg was named after Radford Gatlin, who only showed up around 1854. Gatlin's claim to fame was that the post office was established in his general store, and before long the entire city was known as Gatlinburg. Now, by all accounts, Gatlin was, well, kind of a jerk, and he was actually chased out of town before the Civil War, but by this time the name had already stuck. You just can't beat good branding. Pigeon Forge takes its name from an iron forge built along the Little Pigeon River in 1817 by Isaac Love. The pigeon in Little Pigeon River comes from the passenger pigeon, a now extinct breed of bird that was very common in the area until <coughs> we ate most of them. <coughs> While you probably won't come across any delicious pigeons in your travels, visitors to the area can see where the iron forge once stood at the Old Mill, a popular tourist destination in Pigeon Forge. Sevierville and Sevier County were both named after John Sevier, the first governor of Tennessee. Sevier's many accomplishments include leading a militia in the Revolutionary War, serving in the House of Representatives, and not dying in a duel with Andrew Jackson. <coughs> the only East Tennessee resident to have a more impressive resume than John Sevier is Sevierville native Dolly Parton. Hey, someone should name a city after her. <laughs> or maybe a theme park. Well, there you have it. Three amazing cities with three uncommon names. Do you know any other interesting facts about Gatlinburg, Pigeon Forge, or Sevierville? Share them in the comments below. And for more information about everything in Sevier County, check out visitmysmokies.com.